and I have security rights to do this, and I'm going to customize this form. Okay, so we're just going to add a quick field here. I just want to show you what this looks like. And like I mentioned before, I went to school for accounting. I implement accounting systems. I'm not technical when it comes to uh, JavaScripting or scripting anything. Um, in SQL Server, I could write SQL statements. I can write update statements, some triggers, some joins, that sort of thing. But within NetSuite, I have not written one piece of code, but I have added tons and tons of custom fields. So I've customized this form. It opened up in this new tab and I'm gonna come in here to fields and you're gonna see here, we have the main window, relationships, sales, marketing, Encore custom fields. These are all the fields that I have in the Encore custom fields tab. I can make these mandatory if I want. I can rename these, I can not show them, or I can add a new field here. So I'm gonna click new field and leave this window. And I'm just gonna call this a demo field for today's purposes. So here are the types of fields I can add, free form, help, hyperlink, images, integer, list records. If I wanna use a list record, I can either select something that's already a list inside of NetSuite. So let's say for some reason you wanted to have link a vendor to a customer, which you can already do inside of NetSuite, but we can go ahead and come down to the vendor list and link this vendor or chart of accounts or departments or classes or whatever you ha have you. If you don't have a list here, you click the plus sign, a new window pops up and it allows you to create your own list rec record. And here I can put in some information. We're gonna make it very simple, A, B, and C. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and save this. And you'll notice it created this demo list record. I have my labeled demo. Where do you want to put this custom field? I'm gonna put this on my customer record. I can put this on the project record, on the vendor employee. I can put it on a lot of different areas. So on the display, I'm gonna go ahead and put it on the Encore custom fields tab. So I'm choosing where to put that. I'm gonna go ahead and save this. <clears throat> okay, come into the customer record. This is a website, it's not here yet. All I'm gonna do is refresh the screen and reload my customer. And when I come to the Encore custom fields tab here, you'll notice here's my new field. ABC. Because I'm administrator in this, in this uh, environment, I can click new and I can add another record just very simply by put in D. Now I have another record here. So I encourage you, if you're looking at other solutions other than NetSuite, obviously we hope that you look at NetSuite. I think NetSuite is the best solution to move from, from Microsoft Dynamics GP, specifically if you have inventory. If you don't have inventory, there are other solutions available. Intact is the number two solution you know, when it comes to cloud, uh, cloud ERPs. It's a fantastic solution, but not really for inventory or manufacturing. If you're, you have inventory, you sell something online, whether it's a Shopify website, big commerce website, NetSuite is the solution for you. I encourage you to ask during a demo of any solution you're looking at, can you add a custom field? That's how simple it is to add a custom field. <laughs>